Hello world, today I'm downloading and installing Kodi 19 for the first time on my Apple TV 4K and I'm using AppDB Pro um, to install it and in one of my previous videos I will leave the link in the description on you know a demo on how to install it and I will leave the instructions, the step-by-step -step, um, written instructions on how to do it. So let's see how this works. You know, I'm very excited. I haven't had Cody installed on my Apple TV in a very long time. And um, I have many other different devices on many different platforms. And Cody performed the best on the Apple TV um, but since this is a very big file um, yeah that's why it's taking so long so uh, this is real-time action and right now I'm running TV OS 13 so this is going to answer your question of is Cody supported on TVOS 13? So we're both going to see it firsthand. All right, there it goes, speeding up. Now to summarize how you know you set up AppDB Pro, first you pay for a subscription for a year. The prices may vary. Um, and then you would have to link an iPhone with the AppDB website, and then you link your Apple TV. Um, you have to do it in that order and then you can use any web browser um, Use your Chrome browser on your Windows laptop on your MacBook um, To install applications from the website to your device. So here it is And it works. So let's go to settings. Yeah, but you've seen it, you know, boot it up. So I have to look for some add-ons to add to this, but now it's back. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video.